Ugandan artists will have a lot to learn from today's low-profile World Culture Day celebrations. Gender and Culture State Minister Peace Mutuzo says the current COVID-19 lockdown has led to the development of partnerships between government agencies that will help artists benefit from their work through digital platforms. This will be accompanied with training on security protocol in the digital environment. I'm therefore happy that at long last, artists will benefit financially from their works. The minister says the onset of the COVID-19 pandemic has grossly affected the arts industry in the country. In Uganda, over 300 events were cancelled. This affected over 700 artists and their fans. And the economic and social emotional costs around it. In total costs, we lost over 150 billion shillings. She believes the future for art and culture in Uganda is bright if the various actors take the path of technology and digitalization to market their products. The emergency of technology and digitalization provides a window for ensuring the content attracts due royalties. I therefore make a passionate call for all Ugandan cultural products and marketing to go online. The Gender Ministry has also created a national platform for local artists for ease of coordination, knowledge sharing, professionalism and entrepreneurship. Sam Poza, NTV Tonight.